What's that noise? My guess is the girl. We need to find her. She's in here. What do you think you're doing? It's okay. Trust me. This isn't right. No way. I assure all gathered here today that our town will be free of the devil's grasp. Together, by God's grace, little hope will prevail. My word on it. This court is hastily convened, but with good reason. If we are to finally rid ourselves of the evil which has infested Little Hope, then we must act today. I accuse you, Mary, of witchcraft. What say you, Reverend? The evidence, as discovered through my investigation, is beyond question. Mary uses her poppet as a familiar to summon and serve the devil. We have been deceived by a child, by her guise of innocence. This poppet was mistakenly used to denounce Tabitha, but it has always belonged to Mary and Mary alone. She allowed her own kin to be executed as she watched in silence. That is not so! Liar! Now this tin child, this creature of Satan, has the marrow to accuse me, a man of God, of wrongdoing. Andrew, these people have lost their minds. This is collective hysteria, paranoia. We've got to intervene. Stop this somehow. It was never my intention to bring harm to this town or its people. Can you not help me? What can I do? If I could do something to stop this, I would, but now in her hour of greatest need, I this child of the damned pleads once more for the Wait. devil's help. I beg the court's indulgence. Please guide me at this time. This is your counsel. We have to stop this. The only madness is right here in this court. Carver, he's the evil one. We have been swayed by malice. The truth hidden from us, but not by Mary. Reverend Carver is the one urging us to believe in the devil. Be silent. This is all You'll his not deceive doing. us any longer. Your true purpose is plain to see. I will see this town purged of all evil. Listen to him. Carver's the one to blame. What must I do to bring little hope back into the light? I fear the Reverend and what he's capable of. You have to stop Carver. It's him, don't you get it? He's condemning Mary to take the heat off himself. I know what must be done here. Be still. What is the meaning of this outrage? What I have just learned sickens me to my core. There are serious questions which must be asked of you. How can a man of God conduct himself in such a way? Mary, your suffering is at an end. You are free to leave. Fool! Misled by a child! Do you not see what she is? The truth stares at you from the depths of hell, yet you see nothing! The devil's daughter has deceived you all! Not me! I see her! I see her! Satan's all! You will pay heavily for your crimes! I was one of the first to fall under your spell. Now all of Little Hope is mesmerized by you! I have not the words. Without you, I would be dead. You saved me. I shall remember you all, my dears. But I didn't save you.
I gotta admit, I'm impressed. You made all the right moves. You called out the priest for what he really was and saved Mary. Why do I feel like I did nothing? Like none of it matters. We should leave. Sorry. I know it wasn't your fault. Both of us have been through some real tough time these past years. About half a mile or so, there's a diner with a working phone. You call for help and you leave this place. And don't you ever come back. Ain't nothing left here for you. I'm real sorry for what I've put you all through. We've all had one hell of a rough night. You more than anyone. That's gonna haunt me forever. You're not alone here. Take it easy on We've yourself. We've all been through hell. That, right? We're finally getting out of this hell. Blame yourself. <laughs> I just wish we all could have made it. We're diverting all traffic through Little Hope. You okay, buddy? You seem a little confused. Yeah, I'm fine. I just want to get these folks to where they need to be. I doubt a short delay will trouble them too much. Just shut up! This isn't helping us find help or getting us out of here. Hi there. How you doing? Excuse me, but we're uh, looking for our bus driver. What? Have you seen him? That's funny. Sounds like you could use a drink. Better not, thanks. I need to keep a clear head. You shouldn't be drinking right now. I don't think it's a good idea. Drinking's all I got left. There's no goddamn us.
What the hell is going on in there? Get the hell out of here. I'll go once I look you in the eye. Now let me in. Hey! I don't think he gets how bad a mess we're in. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again, see if you can get a different result. That's the problem with demons. If you don't lay them to rest, they will haunt you forever. Not a bad effort. Some found redemption, some didn't. All you're doing. And you eventually found him the bus driver maybe he can now put the past behind him <sighs> until we meet again Maybe in the Arabian desert. Maybe somewhere else. But we will meet again. At least one more time. Spare me over 
for another year. Oh, death, oh, death, won't you spare me over for another Absolutely not. We'll start believing. We are under attack by... I don't know what. You wouldn't believe me even if I tried. Hell, I don't believe it and I was there. In Sumerian myth, they say the souls of the dead went deep underground to the House of Ashes. Where they lived on dust, plagued by the demons of the underworld.